something else that's exciting happening on this Earth Day, and it comes to us from our PTL partner, Noble Environmental. We have shared the good works they're doing in our community before. And now, Noble is going above and beyond for Earth Day by awarding something they call Green Grants. Selena Pompiani explains. But first, asks us to tell you that this story was recorded before the mask mandate for Pennsylvania went into place. So you won't see any masks here, just proper social distancing. Watch. Hey everyone, Selena Pompiani here. Today is the 50th anniversary of Earth Day, so to celebrate, Noble Environmental has some big news to share that will impact several communities and organizations. I'm here today with the co-founder of Noble Environmental, Alex Okowski. Alex, you got a lot to share today. Yes, Selena, we're really excited. Uh, we're giving away $50,000 worth of green gifts to communi communities and organizations throughout the Pittsburgh area. That's great news, and why did you decide to do this? We have a garbage hauling business, county hauling, that picks up waste throughout Pittsburgh, and then Noble Environmental turns that waste into energy, and we wanted to partner with like-minded organizations throughout Pittsburgh. That's great. So you found projects that work to promote social, human, economic, and environmental sustainability. You vetted the projects, and now you're ready to announce all the big winners. Yes, and our first winner is Arc Human Services in Cannonsburg. They serve individuals with developmental disabilities, and this gift will help them build a new headquarters in downtown Cannonsburg. Inside will be a retail and studio space to provide job opportunities for people with all abilities. Next is Queen of Angels North Huntington. This green gift will help them create an outdoor learning space that addresses a critical need for students to understand how their actions impact the environment and to reconnect students with nature. Then we have the City of McKeesport. This green gift will support Mayor Cherepko and the McKeesport Rising Project to improve the quality of life in McKeesport. Specifically, this money will help purchase life-saving AEDs that will be placed throughout the community. Also, the White Oak Rotary. They are building a makerspace inside the La Rosa Boys and Girls Club of McKeesport with the help of a noble environmental green gift. The Cannonsburg Police Department. The police chief plans to use the green gift to purchase a ballistic shield to protect officers in ways that body armor cannot. Next is Communities Moving Forward. They are an association of concerned citizens, including Mayor David Rome of Cannonsburg, who are launching the Fresh Start Cafe, a safe place to gather, socialize, and receive support for addiction, loneliness, or mental health. And finally, congratulations to the West Elizabeth Police Department, who are working hard to combat distracted driving. This green gift will be used to purchase a speed timing sign to reduce the risk of high speed crashes. That's wonderful news, Alex. I'm sure all of these organizations are thrilled to receive the support of Noble Environmental. And over the next several weeks, we will be highlighting all of them to show you the great work that they do to build a sustainable community. Reporting for Pittsburgh Today Live, I'm Selena Pompiani. Great to see such positive support. I know, and so many winners there. That yeah, was fantastic. It's awesome. Yeah. Thanks to Selena and to Alex for that. Yeah, and we want to thank Noble Environmental for the green grants and also for sponsoring our green room here at PTL.